Singapore Defence Minister Ng Eng Hen says the biggest threat to peace in the region is uh, misunderstandings and miscalculations rather than any one single country, and that the five-part defence arrangement acts as a stabiliser, a military grouping that works together for peace or regional stability. Member nations commemorated the FPDA's 50th anniversary with a fly pass and naval vessel display. It also marked the conclusion of a two-week-long exercise, Bersama Gold, involving about 2,600 personnel from Australia, Malaysia, New Zealand, Singapore and the United Kingdom. Under the agreement, the five countries will consult each other in the event of external aggression or threats against Malaysia or Singapore. Dr. Ng says the FPDA remains relevant, non-threatening and is not directed at any one country. I don't think we are, uh, the security context in this region demands that uh, a military grouping where you can trigger it very quickly. I mean, uh, it's a peaceful region and uh, if there are hostilities, the more precipitous ones are really like terrorism, which can come unannounced. But uh, the traditional threats, country to country, I mean, as you, uh, as you know, or as you rightly observe, there are no impending threats. So I think the posture of the APD is adequate for our security challenges. Dr. Ng was also asked about reports that China had recently tested a nuclear-capable hypersonic missile, which China has since denied. You can't stop countries for looking for new military capabilities, but I, I think it's far safer for all of us if they do it under the umbrella of uh, 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 understanding if they do it uh, under the umbrella of continued dialogue of setting the rules if you like and uh, I think that will give comfort to all of us so uh, we continue to look at these technologies which advanced com countries have and uh, I look forward to uh, meeting my counterparts to discussing these issues uh, when I meet them